Yo, 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 how are you all doing? I had to take, I had to do a second cut. Usually, usually it's all first time, but my bank, my bank card accidentally flashed. So, <laughs> so yeah, it, it was, I was only like a minute in, but yeah, we're good now. Okay. So, you know who I am? My name is Sam Brook. Um, I'm a musician, an independent artist from the UK. And yeah, Sam Brook Sundays is, you know, I just do, a, I do a, a series every Sunday where I just document and progress my journey to becoming a full-time musician. You know, I just... I just, I just say what I've been up to and what I'm looking forward to doing next week. Because usually I do this, um, usually I do this, before, uh, just straight after I do a call with my, my boy Ollie, where we do like a, um, like a, like a recap of the week. So I like to do my own recap just on YouTube. So yeah, if you're interested in my progression as a full-time musician, if you want to check out any, uh, any of my music out, link in the description. I don't know why I keep... I keep starting recently, I don't know what's wrong with me, but, but yeah, um, this week's been really good, I'm not gonna lie to you, um, I'm seeing a lot of, a lot of growth with my social media, and I did a lot of Sandbrook Sundays on my music account, but I, this is a new account, and I, I changed it because I want this to, you know, be sent to the right people, and that's kind of the theme with a lot of my social media stuff, so, with TikTok, I made a completely different TikTok account, because, I realised on the main account, well, to be fair, the main account is no longer the main account, <laughs> but, um, so on my first account, um, like, it was getting, it was getting, like, low views, and, like, I don't, I don't, I don't recommend you changing the account just because it's getting low views, like, there are completely, like, that should be your last result, but for me, it was more low views, low engagement, like no comments, no like. No, I was, I was still getting likes, but no comments, no follows, and it was just it was just getting getting very stagnated, getting very stagnated. So I thought, let me try this out. There's no harm in creating a new, a completely different account, and let's just see what happens. And as soon as I changed a new account, so basically what I did was, I all the accounts I followed, all the stuff I liked on in the new TikTok account, all music. Okay, there is nothing. If you go on my for you page on the on my current account now that I do. For you page, music, 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 because it's the only thing I like. So literally, my my algorithm is just all music, all all independent artists trying to promote their music like I am. All my followings the same musicians. Um, yeah, the hashtags, the content is all about my music. Whereas in the other account before when I first started, like my first my first video was me and my girl. Um, shout out Emily. She um she packed me Zidane on FIFA. Oh yeah, that's great. That is amazing. You pack music down. Woo! You got like a thousand views. That's great. But TikTok are immediately like, okay, you're 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 a video game. You're a video game um, content creator, TikTok creator. You're not a music creator. So automatically, it shifts to where you actually want your, you know, where you want your audience to be. Direct, you know, where you want your content to be directed to. So literally straight away, it was messed up. So. The, I recommend if anyone starting music out straight away, literally don't. And I'll get back. I'll I'll get to this point. But what I'm saying is, st literally, do not make use an existing account that you've been using before for just personal stuff. Like if it's an Instagram account, which I'll get back to, do not use like your personal account that you just post pictures of yourself. Make a completely fresh account. I'm I'm serious. Make a completely fresh account. Okay. If you're an aspiring musician and you want your you know your your content to be you know t towards the right people you know to the right fan base the right audience to grow an actual fan base a community you have to start fresh completely fresh because literally from the first thing you do is so important you have to have the right literally so yeah we can go to instagram now. um yesterday which was so saturday um on the 16th of march i created a new account created a completely new instagram account because Again, like I said, it, this should be your last result. But this Instagram account that I had before, it was an old account. You remember, I, I don't know, you might know this, but back in the day, there used to be stuff like spam accounts. So basically, you'd have like your personal, I don't know why everyone thought, <laughs> for some reason, every, everyone in my year had one. We all thought we were like celebrities and shit. But um, so the main account would be like, you know, just pictures of you, good pictures of you. And then the, the, the spam account would be like, uh, eating this, or going for a walk, or like just anything random. 
but like only your close friends would have the spam account that's essentially what my music account my old music account was like this was before reels even existed so so basically like my first video so basically all your video posts turned into reels when reels came about so I had a video post of like, <laughs> like um, a Roblox character punching a wall with like Kanye West power in the background, <laughs> like five years ago. <laughs> like, and that was my first reel. So think about it. Take, um, Instagram reels are like, how can this be a music account? <laughs> like this guy, is just a, a Roblox character punching a wall. So from the get go, I was screwed because it's just the wrong people. Like even the archives, even the archives are just old pictures of me when I was younger. Like that is not. Like, how are t how are Instagram? How is your Instagram account? How's the Instagram algorithm meant to know that your account is a music account, regardless of like the new content you posted? It was originally a spam account. Like the followers, were be are just people in my year, like in in school, like <laughs> they were just my in my year group at school. Like these these people, like yeah, I appreciate all the people that have um that kept following me, that kept following me, <laughs> that didn't unfollow me because like it switched to music, but. Let's face it, these people following me aren't following me. Most of them, and it, like some of them are, obviously, and I appreciate all the support, but most of them are just following me because they know me from school. Or they know, just they know me, rather than they actually follow me from, for my music. And the thing is with Instagram Reels, which I, I've been doing a lot of research, and it's more, Instagram Reels is, it's different to TikTok, because TikTok just posts 200, TikTok just posts like, to 200 people basically 200 random people well not the random people but your target audience right and if those 200 people like that content it will then sent it will be sent to another 100 people 300 people and then it will go to another 200 people 500 people and then if the, if the you know if the algorithm the analytics are good you'll send it to a thousand then ten thousand then a bit and then so on and so forth instagram's different in the fact that they send it first to your followers right and then if your followers like it, then they'll send it to new people. So for me, it was messed up from the get-go because my followers weren't following me for my music. They were following me because they, they knew me or they were already following me, my spam account. <laughs> spam account. I, I actually hate that. Yeah, well. Um, yeah, so from the get-go, they weren't watching it. And like, I'm not, I'm not like, I'm not like criticizing anyone. Fair enough. I I don't expect anyone I don't expect every single person to like music. Like that's fair like I'm not that's just how it is. Like not everyone's gonna like music. But it was it was really damaging me because if my followers are swiping, then Instagram are kind of like Instagram Instagram, the mind of the Instagram algorithm is like, if your followers are swiping, why should we send it to people who aren't even your followers? So that's just kinda how it works. So I kinda went, you know what? Although, on oh my own, I think the account before was 135 followers. Now I'm on 20. Okay, you know, it's it's quiet. But, like, I'd rather have 20 people that are actually... I mean, I'm sure there will, there will be some more who join because I'm, I'm going to make another story saying, like, this is the last chance to follow, blah, blah, blah. But from the old account, just put on my story, like, follow the new one. But I'd rather have followers who are genuinely just deaf music rather than... People just follow me because they know me, or they just continue to follow that old account. It makes sense. Like, just think about it logically. Like the followers, you want to have followers that are actually like are following you for your music, not because they know. You. So, and it's it's really important for Instagram, and same with TikTok. Like, um, I think so. What I'm trying to do now is every week, every Sunday before I go to bed, I record. I'm going to record statistics so every single week. I like to, you know, I'm going to check the growth. And um, this week I gained 100 followers for TikTok, which is like insane because on the account before, like the the main, the the, the, for, the, the account, the former TikTok account, it was on 186 followers. And I started that like a year ago. So I gained 100 followers in a week, whereas in the other account, I gained 186 followers in like a year. And that's down to a few different things. Um, this week, basically, a lot of independent artists they they um they always say like, if you want to be good at TikTok, study the app. Literally, just use it as much as you can, and you'll learn 
how other people are doing it and basically i just found this guy right and a lot of people are doing it as well like this isn't just me but i think he must have copied it with someone else you know that's how trends work okay like it is what it is so i found it and it was like it was like a slidey one the carousel one i don't know what they call it on instagram uh, no tiktok they call it photo mode instagram carousel yeah it doesn't make a difference but tiktok it will say so basically a picture of me so i'd be like or like so it was like com um Congratulations, your algorithm has brought you to an independent artist who replies to every single comment. So the, the viewer the, the viewer's like, oh damn, oh damn, that's it. Second one will go, Bam, hi, my name's Michael, blah 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 blah. No, hi, my name's Sambrook. I'm an independent artist. Comment or say anything, and I'll respond to every single one. Bam. So already the viewer is enticed to comment. Comments is amazing for TikTok because Comments takes, you take longer time to, um, you know, stay on the post. So the longer time you're on the account, the on the or on the photo mode post, or just the TikTok. TikTok going to show it to more people, and also people like to look at other comments. So again, they're spending more time on the TikTok, which is great. Again, that shows to more people, more followers, and I, and then the third one I put, thank you for giving me your time, or I'm so glad the algorithm has brought you here because that's good for the keywords for TikTok. Feel free to follow me, to join me on my music journey. Bam. 20, it gets like 20 followers. It's, no, I wouldn't say 20, 20 followers. On average, or if I, if I post four times a week, four times a day, I get like 100 followers a week. Why, why am I acting like I can do maths? It's quite good. It's quite good. I'm not going to say, I don't know what the average is, but it's less, probably less than 10. But some, some posts get like 20 followers. Some get like three or four, but some do really well. And uh, I was saying to my boy Oli in the call, how can I optimize it? How can I find ways to kind of... Because obviously, if you're a follower, you don't want to keep watching the same thing. I know, like, it says in the analytics that 2% of the people that are watching it are followers. So 2% are followers. So it doesn't actually matter. But obviously, I, I like to change it as well. And I found a new one where it was like, Joji, Joji blew up. Um, I, knew, I, I knew Joji before he blew up. I knew Conan Gray before he blew up. I knew Lizzie McAlpine before ceilings went viral. Um, you could say the same for me. Blah, blah, blah. And it works. So that is really working for me. Photo mode is really doing well on TikTok. I've actually been messaging a lot of content creators, um, uh, musicians, not content creators, a lot of musicians whose music I really like and whose platform, you know, they're not like, they're not much bigger than me, but I'm saying like, they have a better following than me, a much better following than me. And, and you know, obviously I like their music as well. But a comment saying like, yo, like, do you have any advice for like, I'd really like to reach your fan base. So like, I think collaborations is really good. If you're, if you want to be a musician and a full-time musician, I think collaborating with people in your niche, in your genre is great because honestly, the more people, the better. So why not collaborate, comment? You can even, you can even, if you're friends with them, if you, if you like their music, even like, if you, if you really like the music, you can ask for a feature, you know, it's like, it's great. Like collaborating is so important in music and it's always been that way. So why not just continue that? So yeah, I'm I'm really pleased with how because you know it's a really nice feeling because I'm getting a lot of uh, so many nice comments and so many nice uh, messages saying how much people love my music and obviously it's obviously it's nice to see like I'd say I start I mean I started making music November 2022 but like my, I I really don't like my first four or five songs I think my first good song till now so the first good song I'd say is I can't change the past and then from then it's been really good. So I'd say, like, yeah, yeah. So I'd say, like, this is, like, my first proper year of making music. Oh, my God, it's happened again. The, um, the lights. I don't know why. It's because I just don't charge it, that's why. But, um, yeah, I'd say, like, this is my first proper year. I think the year before was kind of, like, my, found, like, felt like a foundation year. So just kind of, like, understand music, like, to find my sound as a musician. And now, like, I've found it. And now that I understand social media a lot more, I'm, I'm, I'm just... Yeah, I think this is, is, is going well. I'm, um, I'm very pleased. And um, obviously it's always nice to get comments because I was saying to I was saying to Emily on the, the account before and I said to Ollie as well, I was like, um, on the on the former account on TikTok, I'd see, I'd see stuff like, this is so bad, this is awful, um, stop making music, um, oh my God, like, this is really, really bad, like, like, like awful comments. Like, 
fair enough, you're gonna get nasty comments, but every like most of them were bad, right? And then as soon as I made this all like this other account, all the comments are so lovely. I don't think I've actually got a bad comment on the alternate account, which is amazing, which is such a nice thing to see. But yeah, yeah, I'm very pleased with how it's going, and yeah, it's just consistency. I'm really gonna push Instagram this week because obviously I've made a new account, so I wanna and apparently labels I mean even though record labels they're not really in my interest at the moment because I'm still starting out um I think it's nice to have just have that nice fan base on Instagram it's important yeah so yeah and I also want to make a mailing list which I will put in the description if you sign up to the mailing list you get 20% 20% off Sandbrook clothing hoodies do I have one do I have a Sandbrook clothing hoodie I do I can wear it they come in black and blue at the moment, but I'm going to introduce a new colour. So yeah. If you sign up to my mailing list, you can get 20% off. Look at the logo. Look how sick it is. Just a sandwich with a nice, nice moon. I'll put, the, I'll put the link in the description. And yeah, the, sign up to the mailing list, 20% off. <laughs> so yeah. Thank you so much for listening. Yeah, I think this is actually... This week is probably my best week of social media, hands down. Like, I've been, doing, I've been doing, I think I was making, I started making TikToks around this time last year. I think that's March last year was when I made my made that first TikTok account. And to make to grow a hundred followers in a week is amazing, and I'm yeah I'm very pleased obviously. So yeah, just keep going. I made some um, goals. So it's just 100 followers, 100 TikTok followers a week. I want to get 30 Spotify followers a week because I did that list this week as well. And it's really good because tra it's translating to Spotify followers, which I'm, really, which I'm really pleased about because, you know, if you were just getting TikTok followers, it's like, okay, it's not really mean anything because obviously you want people to go to your music, but it has increased my listeners, so it's really good. 20 Instagram followers a week, 10 plus listeners every day. I think, um, and a new idea every week. So a new idea for the content I'm making. So like the Joji one, where um, Joji, I knew Joji before he blew up. That was a new idea. So I'm trying. To, I'm gonna make a new one this week. I'm just trying to like diversify stuff. So yeah, I've already got a lot of stuff for Instagram, and yeah, I will let you know how it goes. This is a long one than I expected. Usually I like ten minute videos, but I just wanted to you know let 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 my my past my future self know how it's going on. March 17th, it's a big, good week, good week. Happy St. Patrick's Day to everyone. I didn't celebrate, I was doing my dissertation. And I watched the Liverpool game. Ha <laughs> ha. My guy, Amadiala, you know, my guy. Even though I don't support United. I respect it, I respect it. I don't like Liverpool, so I respect it. Um, In a bit, I'll see you next Sunday. Bye-bye.